Michael Kaminsky, Sublimation 101, Branchburg, New Jersey, coming to you from our showroom. We're here today with an idea that I got from my sister-in-law, Floor. The idea she gave me today is something for her daughter, my niece through Martha, is the wedding tote. We went on Etsy. I started laughing. I said, Floor, you know I can make that. She said, no say, Michael. I said, oh yeah, check this out. So she goes, she pops it up on Etsy. I saw $29.99, I said, Floor, you can pay me. But we're going to show you how fast and easy we can do these bags, simple and clean. Can I just jump in there real quick, Gisela? Basically what I'm going to do right here real quick is have my design right up on the screen. Done, ready to go to print. I opted to print big. So we're going to take our sublimation transfer, came right out of our printer like so. Notice we have our tote bag laid down onto the press with the handle out. The reason we want the handle out, it'll leave lines where the handle will be. The key part is remembering not to put it down face this way because that's what we're used to. We want to go upside down. So we're simply going to take our beautiful image. We're going to line it up into the designated area of the tote bag we want. I decided to do a full bleed all the way across. I mean, if it's for family, I might as well do it right or, don't, or go home, right? And we all know that one. Make it beautiful for your family. Simply line it up. I'm going to go two fingers from the top. One, two, three. I'm going to lock my press down. 400 degrees for one minute. Remember, print, press, peel, profit. Keep it simple. Keep it easy. So our press is cooking. While we're going, we're going to do another video shoot tonight. We are going to do... What is it? <laughs> Sublabox. It's a handy dandy box. Store your winter belongings, store shoes, good for sports. Put it in the trunk of your car. Remember, your kids come off, they have dirty cleats, dirty shoes on. Put them in the Subla box. So easy, so fast, heavy duty, and durable. Remember, often imitated, never ever duplicated. We're going to open up our press. It's just about finished. We're going to pop it right open. We're going to remove it. And I'm going to turn around. I'm going to ask my sister-in-law to come on over here for a minute. I'm going to say to her, Floor, is that what you were looking for? Beautiful. This is my sister-in-law, Flo Rossi. Everybody say hello to her. This is for my niece from through Martha. But we weren't going to do. This is exactly what she saw on Etsy. I made it here myself in less than one minute. Beautiful. Come on over, we're going to do Sublabok. Look at Flora all excited with her bag. you got to love the excitement. Sublabox comes in a bag. We're simply going to open it up. No, we cannot use the bag for Sublabox, but we can use the bag for something else, I'm sure, in our business, because it is an adhesive bag. Simply remove Sublabox from your, your bag. Open it up. Look, there's nothing inside. This is going to make it even easier. Printed out a nice Rome Coliseum picture. I'm simply going to line up everything I want to go right into Subla Box. And I'm going to put two pieces of tape to hold it right in place. Remember, this is a thicker item. So I want to adjust my pressure accordingly and press it for 400 degrees for one minute. While that is going, I'm simply going to take my topper and my bottom. That's how Subla Box gets its secureness. And we're going to pop it right open. After we pop it right open, you're going to notice that there is sides. One has Velcro, one does not. The non-Velcro side goes into the bottom of Subla Box. I think I got it. You got the point there, didn't you? So we're simply going to take our Subla Box. I'm going to set it on the counter because this one with the Velcro removable and washable goes with my lid. We're pressing away with our Subla Box. Our cover should be almost done. Easy, fast, and innovative. Remember, everything we show you at Sublimation 101. Print, press, peel, profit. Giving you and your business the final P, profit. Supple box is finished. I open it up. I remove my transfer. I take my two pieces of tape off. Now when I go to Italy, I can have a memory box and put all my memories from my vacation right into one box. Take the cover again, was removable with the Velcro. Snap it right into place like so. 
That's what gives st Supple Box its durability. There is a strap right here, just in case you want to use on the inside to lock anything in place. In case you overstuff it, look. A holding strap. Store your sublimation supplies in there, your inks, your uh, stuff for Velcro, for embroidery, everything. Put it right in, close the lid, two handles ready to go. That's a box of a box right there. Subla box. So many uses, so easy to make. Visit us at www.sublimation101.com. Call us toll free at 1-877-528-8288. Anytime for anything. Remember, we're often imitated. Never, ever duplicated. Thank you very much and have a great night.